It says that it is the world's first rotating bass lure. I got one. Oh. I got one. Oh wow. Oh, I got one. Got him. I finally caught one. Oh, oh, it's decent, bro. It's decent. Get up here. Yes. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're out here and today we have maybe one of the craziest soft plastics that I've ever seen and today we're going to be fishing with it. So right here in my hands we have the swimming snake. Now you guys know I've thrown a snake lure in the past. It was very realistic. It was a top water bait but this right here is a soft plastic and it has a very interesting design to it. It says that it is the world's first rotating bass lure so i'm interested to see what this thing's all about we're going to see if it's any good or if it's just a gimmick so today we have three colors of the swimming snake and uh, as you guys can see on the back right here it says just cast and retrieve swimming snake does the rest triggers feeding and territorial strikes catch bass when bass are not feeding that last one has me interested because you know when the bass fishing is slow you want a lure that's going to attract them and maybe the swimming snake is going to do just that so let's go ahead check this thing out out of the packaging tie it up and then see if we can't go catch some fish all right so right here we have our swimming snakes we have multiple packs of them a few different colors we have the black moccasin color which i'm actually i actually kind of dig that they name these things after snakes we have uh, the black magic, which is a, uh, a black color with some like uh, little flakes in there. And then we have the watermelon red. So we have a lure in there, which is basically the hook in the swimming snake head right there. And then you get uh, basically three plastic worms, one that comes already rigged up and two in case you need an extra one. So we have lots of colors today. Today we have an overcast day. It's actually raining a little bit right now. So honestly, I think either the black magic or the uh, the black moccasin is going to be our go-to. So uh, let's crack one open. We're going black magic. Look at that color. It's got some purple. It's got some red. It's got some white. I'm digging it. Let's see. Let's get our swimming snake out of the package. There she is. This color actually looks beautiful. The swimming snake is, it's, it's, it's actually kind of cool. I'm not going to lie. Look at that. The one thing that I'm very curious to see is on the back of the packaging, it shows it kind of rotating. Is it actually going to look like a snake or is it going to look like whenever your soft plastic worm slides down the hook and it does that? If you know, you know, that action where it just rolls over. We're here to test that today. We have our snake head right here, which is a... Uh pretty hard it's got eyes in it and then we have our rotating part so i guess this is just going to kind of swing around and then we have our hook which is actually kind of angled so that's very interesting like i said today we're here to see if it's a gimmick we're here to see if it's any good we're testing this thing out we're going to judge the action fish catching ability looks in the ideal are there i kind of i kind of dig it the swimming snake very interesting bass fishing lure i have high hopes for this thing so i hope it, it doesn't let me down. All right, so the only thing left to do is to tie up our swimming snake. I'm actually kind of hyped up for this. I bought three of these, three different colors, and uh, there was a decent amount of colors. So, I mean, you got options. I'm just interested to see if the action is any good, especially since they said that you could catch bass that didn't want to feed and get them to eat this thing. Well, there she is, the swimming snake. She's already rigged and ready to go. And that's one thing I already like about it. You don't have to do none of the uh, the rigging up. It's ready to go. You can take one straight out of the packaging. And uh, I kind of really dig this color. It's got some purple in there, black. I mean, this could be perfect to, for today. We have very little time to fish because daylight savings time, not it. So let's go ahead. Let's test the action. Let's start catching some fish and see if we can't maybe reel in a lot with the swimming snake. Well, here goes nothing. The swimming snake. Let's see what we can do with it. Let's test the action. The action is probably the most important part here. So you just cast it out there and just... Oh boy. It looks like I thought it would look like. It looks like the plastic is messed up on a Texas rig. But I'm not going to knock it. I'm going to fish with it. We're going to see what happens. We're going to straight out cast it and see what happens. Like I said, it, it's a little, it looks to me 
like your worm is messed up and you know it does the little dangle but we'll give it a reel it said just to cast it out there and just straight retrieve it i think i mean it looks cool but like it looks exactly like i thought it would like a messed up worm and like even the worm is kind of like crooked too like it has a crooked look to it maybe it's trying to get that snake snake looking action to it. i don't know but we're reeling this thing and i think that's how we're gonna fish it it's rotating it just it doesn't look very natural it looks just like your worms messed up dude i'm not even gonna lie the twitching action is the way to go that thing actually looks amazing the straight up retrieving the the swimming i don't know about that but the twitching looks pretty good i think i'm just gonna twitch it it had the best looking action the straight up retrieve kind of looked a little sloppy it was like a messed up soft plastic this with it twitching actually kind of looks snake like it's moving a lot especially the back of that tail Let's see look at that it is 441 currently and it's basically dark all right it looks like it's actually raining harder now so i hope the fish are biting I, mean, I don't really care if it's raining as long as the fish are eating that's what the the real problem is going to be which uh it seems like we have a good day so hopefully they are got to find out our swimming snake needs to get us one that's for sure we didn't have a single bite the other day oh there's one. Oh, we dropped it oh my gosh that was a good one too oh my gosh i was trying to make sure it wasn't a tree still got it i think oh my god what the heck dude that was a good one that had it oh my god all right so it is currently day number three i've been out here for two days in the cold and in the rain trying to catch a fish and i couldn't do it so i brought some backup with me right here we got george check those bad boys out is this what you brought me out here to fish with yes the swimming snake look at that why does it say rotating it doesn't really rotate i'll be honest so i brought george out so we have two swimming snakes in the water and we're gonna try and catch some fish that's the goal it's still raining it's still cold and uh i haven't been able to catch a fish with them so hopefully today that changes called logan off after i got out of school today didn't have work said let's go fish and we didn't really have anywhere to go fish so he said oh, man. come help me out with this I can't catch a fish on it. I need help. So I brought in the big guns. I haven't been able to catch a fish on this stupid thing for two days. In the cold and in the rain. How grassy is it over there? Is it snaky? If I see a snake, I'm screaming like a little girl and I might cry a little bit. There we go. I got a bite. I just got a bite. I got one. Let's go. It actually can catch a fish. Yeah, but you're right. It's not in yet, buddy. Chill. Oh, no. Chill. Shut up. <laughs> oh, frick. <laughs> hey, it was on a Texas rig with the swimming Dude. snake is still in its mouth. Look, the snake is in there. Yeah, it just. The snake is right the snake there. Snake head, but it still counts. I, I just changed up my snake head. I didn't like the eyes on it, so I made it all black one. Oh, maybe you just didn't like the fact that there's like 18 swivels on it to get it to ro rotate, you know? Doesn't matter the size, a fish is a fish. And y'all should be impressed. What the heck? Yeah, you should be impressed because I've been out here for three days and couldn't catch one. <laughs> See ya. All right, now I have to catch one on the stupid snaky head. Let me just show you guys up close and personal about this thing. <laughs> it looks like a tungsten weight, but it's very light. I guess the hook is actually like made into it too and then you have a a little o-ring and then you have a swivel connected to a swivel a really ugly deer tail, dude. yeah maybe maybe like the most old school looking lure you could throw right now so like that looks like something a fish would never bite i'm not gonna lie to you the packaging was kind of cool it was kind of cool i think it maybe got me <laughs> the packaging definitely got me and you know the one thing i also noticed like if you pull your worm in It'll be straight because it was like the extra ones. This one's like all curved because it was in the form of a snake. I got another one. Oh, I lost him. Oh, he bit my worm off, dude. He bit my worm in half. Rest in peace, slithery little snakey. Don't say snake, bro. I'm walking through all this. That's right. I bit twice and I never had a chance. I got one. Oh, wow. 
as I got bit, you hook up, maybe they're going to get active. If I had a snake head right now, I'd throw it, but I don't. <laughs> I have one. <laughs> that ain't bad. That ain't a bad one. Ain't a bad one at all. Look at that hook set, dude. Straight in his lip, bud. These Guggen hooks are great, dude. Just use code Logan at checkout. Save 10% off. Right. This will be the real test. Both have, hey, both SLX DCs. Why is your rod tip crooked? <laughs> Nothing wants this stupid snake lure, dude. Nah, that's the cast right there for real, though. I have a good, good, good feeling about it. Would you buy it for seven dollars? Actually, I got them on sale. I think they're like five bucks. Oh, I got one. Got him. I finally caught one. Oh, oh, it's decent, bro. It's decent. There's a stick going in my leg. Dude, that's a good one. Oh my gosh. This is actually a good fish. Oh, oh, something touched my leg. Lay down. Nope, 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 nope. Get up here. Yes. <laughs> there goes the rod. The Texas rig, baby. That's the way to do it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think the Texas rig is the only way to fish this thing, if we're being honest. Look at that. God, he doinked it. That feels good. I sat out here for two days, the past two days, all week. And the uh, rain and the clouds, I haven't caught one. So at least it's a nice one. Do we even call it a swimming snake if it's on the Texas River? It's just a worm at that point, right? It is the swimming snake for video sake. Yeah, but I mean, mm. technically the, the worm. It's a leaf. Good fish. There he goes to the depths. Heck yeah, baby. We got one on the swimming snake. Well, all right. If it's on the, the Texas rig, it's just a snake. The snake worm, that's what we call it. This is a nice tree. I think it was just nature watch for real. Forget the swimming snake or whatever the frick this thing is. And a hot cocoa tasting. I mean, look at that. Here's a great way to gauge the, uh, the action on this thing. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> it really doesn't do anything. There's no, you fish with the hook exposed? Why does mine not look like that? So you rig it like it basically fell off, is what you're saying. There's no chance that works, bro. There's no chance. <laughs> <laughs> it still doesn't do it. It still doesn't work. Oh no, it does. It rotates. Not very good it's though. It's so much better than it was. It was better than it was, but it's not really an improvement. Yeah, it is. All right, let's go to the other side of the pond. Let's try it over there. I'm gonna tie on a snakehead too. Like, I think the problem with this lure is, like, it's the worm is just a regular worm, you know? Like, if it was a thicker worm and it was, like, you know, a little bit longer and actually looked like a snake, I feel like it wouldn't be the worst thing ever. And the bait will rotate. If you tie it to the top of the swivel. It's very simple. It's very okay. easy. It's great for any at any level. Tight to the south of the You know, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm tapping out. <laughs> I can't throw this thing no more. I just watched the whole video on it, dude. I can't throw it anymore. That's I think it's I will watch you throw it around, but I can't or, throw uh, it. We cut that on the parse. Tag in. What did the video say? I don't know. I just watched a pro fisherman talk about it. What do you say about it? He said he can fish it anyway. There's not wrong way to fish it. I said liar. <laughs> the wrong ways to fish it is how to is to fish it, honestly. I always gotta bite my No chance. Is it actually a fish or was No, it... like dead serious, it popped it like four times. I'm so glad I just took everything off and quit. <laughs> hey lion. <laughs> quit lying out. There. I no swear chance, I just got bro. hit again, dude. I swear on no everything. Chance. Like it's pulling my worm. There's a lot of trees over here. No, okay. Trees don't bite, fish do. The past three days have sucked. Along with got the one. Oh, no! Did you see him flash? No, we got, you got hit my head with the snake. Did you not see oh, him no, flash? He's, bro. he's bit in the same spot. There's no way as a fish. I ranked the snake a two out of ten. 
and I give it a two because the idea is there. Execution, not so much. I'm disappointed. Okay, I haven't been out here for three days, but from what I've seen, four or five. Just, okay, I had a bite there. Logan doesn't believe me. It was a tree. Does a tree have a white side and like swim away Some after it comes them. off the hook? Some of them. <laughs> I give it a four or five. I caught fish on it. Texas rig. Hey, the guy in the video said you could Texas Bro, rig. Look it. at the, the GoPro strap on the way. Dude, it's my bra. Oh. Today has been awful, man. It has not been good. Hey, we didn't catch fish though. It beats my two days Let's out go! here with the lure and not catch a single thing. So we caught fish. Would I recommend it? No. It was a good thing they were on clearance because I'd Buy be pretty disappointed. All of them for $8 each. I got them for clearance, so it was worth it. It was worth it for the struggle. It was just, a, it was just such a small worm. I was saying earlier, if it was like a bigger worm and it was executed a little bit better, it could be really good. But if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and a comment. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Stay fishing.